Our next coach this morning, the head coach of the Presbyterian College of Code, Harold Nichols. Good morning, Coach. Good morning, Mark. Hope you're doing well. Blue Hoes on the short end against Liberty yeah, held the flame for the fewest points they scored against the best, best opponents this year. Uh, unfortunately, still fell short. We can open up and talk about that game. Uh, then we'll start talking about big questions. Talk about NFL. Well, you know, Liberty's got a very good football team. Uh, knew that going into the game. Um, you know, I felt like it was a well-played game standpoint of you know, teams going after one another. It's a big South matchup. And, you know, I was really proud of, of, of our kids, the way they competed. Um, you know, we played uh, pretty well defensively. The problem was on, on, on the offensive side of the football, we turned the football over and made it a short field a couple times for them. Um, you know, we had a field goal block there in their second quarter. I uh, never really could get on track and get another drive going. And uh, it just really just on the offensive side of the ball and something we're going to have to have to get fixed. And, uh, you know, we got some, got some guys out with some injuries. You know, we had to kind of mix and match a little bit in some places. But, uh, uh, you know, Li- Liberty deserved to win the football game. And, uh, you, know, uh, you know, so we we got to go back to work and, and get ready for a really good Kennesaw team. Um, you know, Coach Bohannon has done a great job with that program down there, and um, you know they've had a, uh, a very good season. They've got a good team. Uh, what they do offensively is very unique, uh, difficult to prepare for. So we're gonna have to have a great week of practice and uh, and get ready to go. So, uh, but we're looking forward to the opportunity. All right, coach. Thanks so much. I will start taking questions. Ask questions. Start one on your phone. Or click the QA link near the top of your browser. Click raise hand if you can point us. Coach, uh, one of the young players I think you were alluding to lost uh, 11 tackles, one for loss. His play over the last several weeks uh, pretty impressive for you. Talk about his development. Uh, during the- yeah, I, I think I think Nick played played pretty well on Saturday. You know, he's a uh, like I say a young player that uh, has gotten better each and every week of the year. Played with more confidence. Knowing his assignment, where to get lined up, and playing fast. That's the thing about young players that you get into is, um, you know, sometimes those guys, you know, don't play as fast as what their abilities you know, lend them to because they don't know where to go. Uh, you know, he's gotten so much better at that part of it. You know, being, being the middle linebacker and what we do with many calls, uh, um, you know, getting getting all those guys lined up is a difficult task. But he's gotten better each and every week and real good. Been really proud of Nick, and I think he's going to be a, a really good player in our league. And uh, Ben T, you know, another day for you. To come back from his injury. How's he been? Is he in his back to 100? He, he's not. He's not 100. You know, he's he's really battled injuries all year long, and he's healthier. I wouldn't say he's healthy. Um, you know, and that's been you know a struggle for him. You know, he has a hard time practicing during the week, and then kind of getting patched up and getting him out there on Saturday. So. We've got to help him, and uh, you know, he's got to play more consistent in order for us to do the football this week against Kennesaw. And speaking of the Owls, just uh, you know, your overall impression, what impressed you most about what they've done this so far? Well, I think I think they're a, they're a tough football team. You know, they, they play with great enthusiasm. You can see the uh, you know speed of the game that they play in that offense with. Uh, you know. And, Defensively, they rally to the football. They're just a well-coached football team, and you know, that's easy to see on film. They've had some big victories themselves this this, this year. Um, their schedule, um, and uh, you know, they're sound in the kicking game. Uh, they just do a lot of good things that equate to winning football, and uh, so we're going to have to be able to match that intensity, match that speed of the game, especially early in that football game Saturday. If we're going to have a chance to go down there and compete, so. Uh, very impressed with them on film. You know, Coach Bohannon and his staff have done a great job getting that team prepared, and uh, they've had a great season so far. All right, Coach, well, I'm not seeing any more questions for you, so we'll go ahead and let you go. But joining us, good luck Saturday. Well, thank you, Mark. I want to wish all the other coaches in the league good luck this weekend. Thank you so much.